Yo, from the top, bro. Let the record show that this is not a safe place. You feel me? The truth is out here. All my words got squatter rights, bro. You know, we back like that with that point that way, you heard me? That nigga DME Detroit a bitch, nigga. The fuck is you getting for? You a bitch, nigga. And since you wanna try to leave a comment creating a false narrative, not only am I gonna put this in full perspective, but I'm gonna put your white ass on the grill, you fucking mutt. You thick ass Chaldean. Fuck is you geeking for? You half breeded Egyptian. Fuck is you talking about, man? I hate niggas like you, but it's cool. So, the nigga leave a comment talking about go DM Shannon again. You fake, right? Now, I'm probably gonna name the video I DM Shannon, you know? So let's let's put it let's put it in full perspective. Let's let's put it all in perspective. So a few months ago, right? I believe it was a few months ago, a month or two ago, something like that. It was definitely a few months ago, right? I hit Shorty inbox. Matter of fact, hold up. Before we even get to that, let's get let's 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 let me let me uh what's the word I'm looking for? Let me speculate on how he knew I DM Shannon. I didn't make this public. I didn't make a video about this. I didn't tweet about. It. Nobody knew I DM the bitch, bro, except for her. So now let's speculate on how he know. So. You know, I made a video. They probably send these videos to her. She probably plugged into the battle rap community and the bloggers. And like, she probably heard some of the things that I said in the video. Probably came off as offensive to her. So, she probably sent, she probably sent my, a uh, screenshot of my DM to a few different bloggers. DM, DM me probably the only one who blogged about it. Maybe niggas directed her that way. I don't know. But he, she obviously even told him that I DM'd her. Or she screenshotted my DM and sent it to him. So that's that's number one. That's how that's what I believe happened. You feel me? That's how I feel like that's how he know I DM'd her because nobody else knew. You feel me? She, the only person that could have told him I DM'd her was her. Now, we got that out there. Boom. So at the time, you know, it was a I believe that around the time I DM'd her, this was right when Barney had like she was in the spaces with those those uh the pap the alleged paperwork and reading the charges and this and this and I made a video about it. That's what's so crazy. Like, but we're gonna get into that. So and I'm just gonna I, yo, y'all know me, I keep it a bean, bro. We're gonna get to the beans right. So I'm gonna keep it a bean. Alright, so I messaged her and I'm I'm keeping it a bean, bro. I'm using all the buzzwords, all the trigger words, all the words that I think gonna make her feel like you know how to be like, like she could, she could feel comfortable with doing an interview with me, cause that was the, that was the uh, gist of me reaching out to her. I was trying to get an interview, bro. I was in my blogger bag. I was in my media bag. I was like, yeah, nigga, if I could be the one to interview this bitch, that'd be lit. You feel me? That'd be traction. That'd be traffic. That'd be views. I'm gonna keep it a bean with you. You feel me? So I'm saying all the right things. I'm saying I'm calling a sis. You feel me? I'm saying shit like, uh, yeah, uh, I know. I, I think I said something like, yeah, I know a, a, a bunch of media people reaching out to you right now. So it is what it is. But you know what I mean? You should do an interview with me. I'm an up and coming uh, battle rap slash media. Bip, 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 bop. And you know what I mean? Let's expose this nigga. You feel me? Now, this is the, I'm going to keep it a bean with y'all. I didn't, me saying let's expose this nigga did not sit well with me, bro. It just didn't because. I wasn't even fully convinced that he was guilty. You feel me? Now, I mean, I was in the middle. You feel me? I did kind of feel like he was guilty of something, but not enough to be using words like, let's expose this nigga. But I'm going to keep it a bean. I had to dress it up in a way to make the girl feel like she would want to do an interview with me. Obviously, it didn't work. You feel me? It is what it is. But I said what I said. What's up, dude? I said what I said though, you feel me? So I dressed it up the way I dressed it up, you feel me? And I said it to her, she never reached out, you feel me? But obviously she seen it because she said it to yo. So that's what happened. That's that's what the fucking DME, I mean the, the DM to Shannon entails. Me trying to say I'm fake because I DM'd her. You feel me? Which I get it. I, I can see how it may look from the from an outside perspective. You making all these videos on Chris on Chris side, allegedly on Chris side, but then behind the scenes you DM'd her, telling her, you know, let me do an interview with you so we can expose this nigga. You feel me? So I can see how, but at the time I was in the middle. I wasn't fully convinced that he was innocent. I wasn't fully convinced that he was guilty. I wanted to interview the bitch. You feel me? I knew it would have been a big interview. I wanted to be the one to, to, to have the interview with her because I'm going to ask the right questions. So me, knowing she a female and she's vulnerable and, 
you know what I mean? I feel like I had to use the right words. I had to call a sis. You know, I had to make it feel like I'm on her side. So I use choice words. Not nothing being fake. I mean, I don't want, I say I can't say I'm fake, even though it didn't sit well with me to say that. But I felt like I, I just, that was kind of something to say to make her feel more comfortable. You feel me? But other than that, like, don't try, fake, fake, and again, a fake bone in my fucking body, you goofy ass nigga. You fake. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? Use a fake ass white man. Right? Because you mix with like Arabic, but you appear to be white. Okay? Oh, no, 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 my bad, my bad. You're a fake ass Arabic. That's what you is. A fake ass Chaldean. A fake ass Egyptian. You fucking mutt. Fuck is you talking about, boy? Fuck out of here, nigga. Now I'm going to keep it a bang with you, nigga. I ain't even really give a fuck if the nigga is guilty or not, nigga. I wanted the interview. Fuck you mean? So I made it sound good. There you go. That's what you wanted to hear? Give a fuck if the nigga was guilty, he did whatever. I don't give a fuck, nigga. I wanted the I wanted the fucking interview. Fuck you mean, nigga. Ain't nothing fake, nigga. Fuck is you talking about, boy? Now sit your mud ass down, nigga. She mad or no? Goofy.